Yo, what's up, guys? It's Crypto Clutch here. I'm going to do a quick video on how to fix something, uh, a common issue I've seen with these Ice River KS3Ms, the new bats. So this would be if you have a November bats, could be also December or, you know, previous batches. I'm not really sure how big this, uh, how many units this affects, but so far it's the second time. I'm sorry, third time I've had to do this on this unit, on uh, my units. So I just repasted uh, the most right unit there, and this is the one that we're looking at on the screen. I just repasted this one um, using this uh, Thermo Grizzly Hydronaut. Highly recommend. Um, one 2.6 gram tube is just enough for doing a whole, uh, all three hash boards. So I'm probably gonna make a video. I, well, I have a video that either will come before this video or after this video on how to repaste the how to repaste your KS3Ms. It probably also works for KS3s and KS2s and 1s, but I only have KS3Ms, so I can't actually show you that model on video. But let's go back to the fix. So if you notice your hash rate is low, and you can see here, I, it's only been running for a few minutes, but as you can see here, I'm only getting 4.6 Terra hash, and if you look at the temperatures, uh, the middle ASIC is very, very low on temperature compared to the other ones. It's also showing only 60 giga hash on the 30 minute hash rate, which is not normal. So the way that I found to fix this is you need to go to iceriver.io's website. Uh, just so we need to go to iceriver.io. Iceriver.io. And then we need to go over to support. Oops, don't click on support. And then go to tutorial. And then firmware download. And then you want to get the latest version of here. So for me, it's this 2023-916, which when you come out and actually install it, um, oh, sorry, not install it, but when you unzip it, and get it ready for uploading. Um, it will be this 5977449 version. Um, just to make sure it's still an issue. So the, yeah, so the temp's still low, hash rate's still low. Obviously, it hasn't refreshed yet, but the temperature being low is the telltale sign of this bug or issue. So you come over here, once you have that downloaded and unzipped, you go to your firmware, select file. I'm already there, but it's probably going to be in your downloads. Do the .bgz, open it, and then hit update. And it's going to ask you, you know, it's going to take a minute, not too long. Well, normally it doesn't take too long. All right, there we go. So operation succeeded. You're going to hit OK. And it's going to ask the CERM restart the miner, hit OK. And now it's restarting. So once it reboots, um, it should start hashing. So I'll be back once it starts hashing. All right, so the miner's back up. You notice that the temperature is still really low. On my last one when I did this, um, it still stayed low for a little bit, but I would give it about two or three minutes to make sure it's not going to start rising because on the other one it did start rising after about two minutes um, even though the other ones were already rising so let's just refresh this and see yeah as you can see now you know, now we're up to 19 C and it's probably gonna start going up more as we start actually hashing um, but I will continue to monitor so this is again the only thing I did was reflash the firmware And now, now, as you can see, uh, temperatures are going up, 25C, 20C, and in a few minutes, you know, we'll get our five minute hash rate and it'll be back at 60 giga hash. So it's just a quick video on how to fix this issue. Um, the first time I did it, I tried to go to the actual hash board and tried unplugging the data cables and just tried doing some stuff on the actual thing, but it was just a firmware bug. I don't know why this happens, but this is the third time I've had to do this. So I figured I'd make a quick video on how to fix it. So hopefully you don't have to send this off, like try and RMA it when there's actually no issue at all. 
So, hope this guys, hope this helped you guys. If it did, leave a like and uh, comment. Peace out.